right folks, Rich Curry for ProWebsiteMaker.com and in this video I just want to illustrate to you um, some things that are covered inside of the Pro Website Maker package uh, product that teaches you basically how to build a website. Now the package gets a lot more in depth. It also gets into a lot of CSS design, cascading style sheets and, also, and, and all of that but I just want to illustrate to you um, some of the things that we do and how easy it really is to, to get a simple site up and start selling product using tables, text, and images. Okay, and uh, I'm just using Dreamweaver here to, to illustrate, but it's the same in, in any web editor. So let me, um, let me just go through this real quick. Um, you're going to create a new file, basic page, basic HTML, and when you do, you're going to get a blank page like this. Okay, now realize I'm going quick here for, for the sake of this being a shot video, but this is all of this is all contained within Pro Website Maker's product. Uh, it's three CDs and tutorials to tell you exactly how to do this and much, much more. So the bottom line is here, if we're looking to do a, a site and um, doing it in tables initially to get started, let me just show you what you do. Um, you just put your cursor out here. Um, and you can you can center it if you want. It's it's, it's not really a, a super big deal. But um, come up here and hit insert. And what we want to do is we want to put a table in. Okay. And in this case, what we're doing here is let's um, you can make this whatever you want, but let's just make it four by say two columns. Okay. Now very 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 critical here. Initially, you don't want this to be percent. Okay. Because if 100%, it would be the whole page, and you don't want that. Now I'm going to put in. Um, Oh, I don't know, seven. Let's say seven eighty, and you want to make that pixels. Now that number didn't fall out of the sky. Basically, uh, this is the you know the width of a typical website can be anywhere between you know seven hundred and nine hundred pixels or so. Okay, so uh, let me do that. Now you see what you have here. Is you've got four tables, and now what I want to do is I want to actually create the top of the page, which is where you would have a header. So it's very easy to do here. Is just use your control button and uh, uh, left click on the PC. And uh, what that does is it's going to highlight these first two cells here up the top. And essentially, you want to merge those together. Okay. So come up to modify. Again, depending upon what editor you're using, uh, your instructions may be a little bit different, but ultimately you're doing the same thing. And you're going to hit merge cell. Now you see what that did? That actually took those two cells up the top now and, and made one big one. Now, this is actually going to be where the top of your header is. And of course, you can dictate the size and all that. But for illustration, uh, I'm going to put header goes here. And this can be the name of your website, whatever you want. Now, just pushing through a little bit here. Um, let's just say you 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 know that's what that's what your text is going to be, and you want to change the font and you want to change some color. Well, within Dreamweaver, of course, you can come right down here in the properties menu, and click on this. And let's do to home, or I, I like that. And let's change the color to oh I don't know. Let's pick green. And let's change the size. This is the font size to say 36. Okay. Now there you go. Now you can see how you have the whole entire header up here of your site. Now the next thing we want to do is add some navigation. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of go over here and I'm, I'm going to slide this over. Now don't concern yourself with the distance. You can move it wherever you want, but. I'm going to come over here into inside of this table here now, and I'm going to center my cursor once again. And what we're going to do here now is we're actually going to insert another table to um, to put our our where our navigation is going to go. Now this time, what I want to do is I want to make sure that this is set to percent, and I want this to be a hundred percent. And what that's going to do is it's going to fill up in here a hundred percent. So it's basically a table within a table. Okay. And we don't need two columns here. We only need one column because it's going to be right inside of the existing. Now, I arbitrarily picked four here for display for rows. Uh, you can have as many as you want. It's for illustration purposes. Okay, now you see what we have here. One, two, three, four. There are our four tables, and this is great to put navigation in. Again, you can center your cursor right down here in the property. And let's just put, um, for illustration, we'll call this nav1. It may be, uh, you know, your home page or, you know, um, 
you get you get my point here. Nav two. Oops, didn't didn't center that. Let's highlight that. Come over here and center that. Okay. So and and now of course you can you can add the same thing. You can just highlight that. You can come down here. You can pick this font if you want. You can come over and make them red. Whatever you want to do, for purely for illustration purposes. Now, as you can see, as the page grows, this area over here essentially is your content area. Okay, so content goes here. Oops, how about I spell? There we go. Okay, now again you can highlight that and you can center it if you want you can color um, I don't know what color you'd want it maybe this color probably not a good color but anyway uh, there's a little bit more to this but I'll wrap the video up now I just want to show you that see here you go you're already on your way to building a site and there, there's a little bit more to this but I just want to illustrate some basics that um, inside of Pro Website Maker, um, the product will actually teach you how to do all of this, how to pick keywords, how to find what your niches are, how to SEO all of this stuff, uh, how to optimize pictures. I mean, the list just goes on and on and on. And by the time that you get done with that product, you'll be able to build good looking websites and you'll be able to apply some cascading style sheets and get rid of some of the tables. And it's just really a great product. So I hope you learned a lot. Uh, again, you can go to the site, which is www.prowebsitemaker.com and then click on the box on the right which is the pro website maker um, product okay I'll see you in another video